Hi everybody, this is our New Year's special and I'm so excited about our guest today. Pharrell told me about this really cool chick named Regina who's a nail artist and she's gonna come do my nails today. She has so many followers on Instagram, something like 200,000. I can't believe she's coming over, I'm so excited. Ah, she's here. Regina! Hi, I'm so glad you came over. Hi, thanks for having me. Oh, stand oh, right there. Right here? Yes. For everyone who doesn't know who Regina is, Hello. Regina is probably like the biggest nail artist on Instagram. She has over almost 200,000 followers. I mean, it's unbelievable. I mean, nail art has just like exploded and I feel like you're kind of the most famous. <laughs> <laughs> Not famous at all, but I do try to do different things mm -hmm. and people really gravitate towards that. And it's amazing even just to see her nails in person, like you can't, it's just, it, it looks like a work of art to me. It's its like its own incredible, it's like you don't even need accessories when you have nails like that. <laughs> your nails are your accessory. Like when I look down at my nails, I swear, it just makes me the happiest. I've been, you know, so excited about meeting you that I've been downloading and looking at tons of okay. nail art things. I found some crazy stuff. I just feel like it keeps getting crazier and crazier. It sort of started with like, you know, stars and moons and now <laughs> it's like hamburgers on your nails. <laughs> So, um, Handy, where's my computer? Thank you. So I wanted to show you um, and you guys some photos of some images that I found. These are the favorite nails I've ever done. Galaxy. Galaxy's so big right now, mm -hmm. right? Now that's airbrush. That's airbrush. Have you seen my hand painting? I have. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. And I can't even believe that you did that with hand painting. All um, with nail polish. Wow. What, what's like one of the craziest you've seen? That I've seen or have done? That you've done? That I've done. Um, you know, recently I just did Andy Warhol inspired nails on like all 10 fingers. So she had like Marilyn Monroe, um, Chad Guevara, all in the Andy Warhol scheme. So that was the craziest one thus far. Wow. That I've done. And do you come up with the ideas or does your clients come to you with ideas? I mean, my client that day, she came in saying, I want Marilyn Monroe in my nail. And I was like, Hmm, okay, <laughs> let's just do Andy Warhol and just do it all up, so. Amazing. The other thing that I think separates uh, Regina from other nail artists I've seen is that like almost sometimes every nail is different, which is so cool. I think sometimes it's just you sort of see the same thing over and over, but like each nail has its own little design. I definitely try to do like custom art for every single client. I wouldn't want my clients walking around with the same nails as everybody else. So. Wow. Well, the reason that I wanted to meet you on this day is because New Year's is coming up. That's so true. I've been thinking about like, what am I going to wear? What am I, you know, what are my accessories? And like nails, I think, mm -hmm. are so important, Very. especially for New Year's. Lots of sparkles and all that kind of stuff. Um, I wanted to show you some of my inspiration. So these are a pair of shoes that my friend made. Um, her name's Jen Brill, and she did a collaboration with Cole Haan. Aren't they crazy? Very cute. And they're very New Year's-y. And so I was thinking, like, these shoes with, like, a really, really, I'm just going to be really obnoxious this year and wear, like, the most sparkly thing mm -hmm. that I can and lots of sparkly makeup. And I feel like when you can do a good nail, you don't even need a lot of jewelry. Absolutely. I mean, look at my nails. Minimal like best jewelry, but mm -hmm. my nails are giving it. Okay, so let's check out some of the things that you brought in your magic box. <laughs> This is my magic box, but it doesn't light up. <laughs> I don't think many people have a box like mine. And I got the magic wand. I bought a couple of things. Like I have some nice, cool polishes for you. Very holiday-ish. I got this gold gold polish from Sephora. Ooh, lots of sparkles. I love this just because of the color. Anything neon, I'm a sucker for. I'm like, whoa. And another thing that's really in right now is like the bedazzling. Yeah. The blingage on like your nails. Like what's on your nails. Like what's on mine. <laughs> It'd be cool to almost match like shoes and yeah. nails or do something in that vein. 
But I'm also really into the ombre. I feel like that's a really cool thing and maybe something easy that people could do at home. Yeah, definitely. We can definitely do that. And especially, it'll match your dress. I like when I get to learn something. I don't even have to <laughs> teach you anything. <laughs> Let's take a look. All right, so um, her nails have already been prepped and we already did a base coat and we let that dry. Um, we're gonna use this black polish. Where, do, where can you buy this? What's the brand? Um, it's called Liquid Leather by China Glaze. Ooh, Liquid Leather, and sexy. Basically, you could buy it at pretty much any beauty supply store. Mm -hmm. Who taught you how to do nails? I taught myself. I went to Sally's, went to Walmart, got all the stuff, and just mm -hmm. learned, just taught myself. Wow. And um, I started doing all of my friends' and family's nails for free. I used to say, like, you know, just buy me some nail polish and I'll just do your nails, just so I could get the practice. So would you just say that practice makes perfect with this? Absolutely. Like, you can never learn something as detailed as this without practice. Where do you get most of your inspiration? I definitely look online. Um, I I read a lot of books. I'm heavy into art. Okay. I've done, like, Takashi Murakami nails. I've done cause. Oh, so you're really into like street art. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Graffiti, yeah. I find that most manicurists, like good ones, are total perfectionists. Are you are you a Virgo? No, I'm a Taurus. <laughs> okay, you must have some Virgo in you because Virgo said rules that. like detail, like. <laughs> you know, I I met Beyonce. Uh huh. So she um she thought I was a Virgo as well, but she was like, you must be born under a Virgo moon. Like oh my she God, was Beyonce's just reading into me. into astrology. Susan, are you listening? <laughs> I love um, Beyonce. That's my number one dream, to do Beyonce's nails. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, maybe we can make that happen. So. so what she's doing right now, she's just painting the tip, just the tip. We're doing a little ombre effect. So this will just create the guide and the gold glitter that we have, we're going to use to uh, blend the two colors together. Magic's about to happen. Do you ever give your nails a break? Yeah. Do you believe in that? Like, I do. Oh, let's take a couple weeks off and I let do. them breathe. I do, but you know, I really can't live without my nails. Right. I can't have everybody else looking cute with cute nails and have me look in a hot mess. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna do one more coat, the only gold for me by Sephora. So and then do you do like a top coat over this? We do. I like to use um, Seshvit's quick drying top coat because it's super duper shiny. This top coat is amazing. It only takes a few minutes to dry. And I like quick drying. <laughs> Don't we all? For impatient women, this is the perfect <laughs> top coat for you. Is there any trick to drying your nails quicker? Um, sitting still. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. like my least favorite part. In order to achieve these sparkly ombre New Year's look, what we did was we used a base coat, liquid leather. It's just a black. We used the Etsy Beyond Cozy. And then to top it off, this is a bigger sparkle. Only gold for me. It's only available at Sephora. It's just a bigger, chunkier gold um, nail polish. And then final top coat. Yep. And that's it. I, I mean, I wish I, these were like tattooed on me because I want them forever. <laughs> I mean, are you going to put your dress on or what? Yeah, I'll do it really quickly. I'll be right back. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. Okay. Happy New Year. Yeah, they came out so great! My nails are perfect! Happy New Year's, everybody! Thank you, everyone. I love you so much. Thank you for watching the show. You're awesome. Leave comments. I'll see you next year. Bye!